Hi, I'm photographer Alec Watson. I work mainly in campaigns and advertising, and I'm lucky enough to get to shoot all over the world for a bunch of different brands that are as diverse as people like Britney Spears, the president of China, and big brands like uh, Microsoft, Starbucks, Coca-Cola, beauty brands like Goldwell, KMS, Sexy Hair. I think I got to do this because of great relationships. And I honestly wouldn't have those great relationships unless I delivered excellence. So my approach is always excellence when I'm taking photos, when I'm on set, when I'm lighting. But equally important is the back end of that and the software end. If you're not keeping track of where your assets are and developing your images to the highest level, you're kind of failing yourself. So software is really important to me. I've over the years become an expert in Photoshop. I use Capture One in the studio for tethering. I've used Lightroom. I've recently been reintroduced to ACDC Ultimate and I've got to say the suites inside here are actually kind of all encompassing almost all the things that I need to do and of the important things absolutely at the highest level. Through this course, I'm going to give you a little tour of my personal workflow and how I use these tools to save time in my life, uh, make more money and deliver excellence to my clients. Through these suites, the first step is the management suite. This is where I get to keep track of my photos and Ultimate does this in a way that I don't actually have another product that can do this. I plug in that drive, the pictures are instantly there. There's no having to go for a coffee while the ingest is done, like bam, my pictures are up, I can see them. That saves me a bunch of time there. But more importantly, it's how it keeps track of my images as a digital asset manager. Damn is the word. And I think it's almost appropriate how this works, damn. As you can imagine, in my life, and maybe for yours too, you end up with a huge number of drives with all your photos on. And very often in, in my life, the, the bonus checks come from two years down the road. Like I'll get an email after a photo shoot saying, hey, we loved this image you did of this. Could you resend us the high resolution? Previously, before, before Ultimate, my version of that looked a little like, okay, I know it's on one of these drives over here. Oh, this one's marked 2015, and I'm gonna start searching and, and looking for that photo shoot. With the asset manager in here, and I'm gonna show you my workflow, all I have to do is type in the keywords. Uh, that drive might not even be on this computer because it got so many drives, but it will tell me. And I was smart enough to Sharpie the name of that drive on the outside of the drive. I plug it in and bam, there's my high resolution instant. I send it out, uh, job done. There's money in the mail coming to me and that's kind of awesome. The develop suite in Ultimate, fantastic. And this is much akin to Lightroom or Capture One. And I can say before adopting this, I absolutely compared all three on some top images that I did because you know, if, if I'm not delivering an image of excellence or there's a piece of software that's going to give me an advantage, I am of course going to go with that. I did comparisons between all three on you know, similar sets of photos and the output, I can say I absolutely got the same quality of output. So being able to be in a develop module with a digital asset manager and working at the highest level, being able to recall my photos when I need to, that was excellent for me. The final suite in this, which you know took it up the next level, is to be ha is to be able to have an an edit suite, an editor that works in layers like Photoshop does. So it's kind of like a Photoshop built in. Now, Photoshop for me as a photographer, I'm not doing graphic design or layouts. That, you know that goes to the magazine people, but but certainly being able to work with filters and layers and masking like I do in Photoshop and to be able to do that in here, that's fantastic. Reason being, say I'm working in Lightroom where I, you know, I don't have that digital asset manager at this level, uh, so I can't find the photo to start with. When I work on it, I have to what's called round trip. It, the photo comes out, it goes into Photoshop, I do edit, I gotta send it back. All of this takes time. I don't have to spend that time in here. And it comes with another bonus of uh, filters that I don't have access to in Photoshop. As, 
as a Photoshop power user, I can do things like work with skin tone and, and soften that, but it takes me time to do that and I can only do it to one photo at a time. That's built in as a filter in Ultimate. There's things that I can do and create actions about. All of this will be in the course and I'll show you my workflow to go through all of these things. Basically, I've got the Ultimate program to be able to find my assets, search for my assets, be able to send them out, batch correct them, develop them and edit them at a level that I can do with any piece of software, yet I get to own this piece of software. And I gotta say, that's pretty awesome. So let's go through these, let's go through these suites and I'll show you how it works. Cool.